Hi guys, it's Brute Bros UK with the LEGO Minecraft The Desert Outpost Set 21121. Here's the box set front with launching TNT and Steve in a boat. The set consists of 519 pieces costing £59.99p in the UK and $59.99 in the US. Ok, let's open and build the set. The set took us 37 minutes to build, you get 5 minifigures with assorted accessories and desert biome outpost. Ok, let's check out the minifigures. The Steve minifigure has purple legs and a light blue torso with printed Steve headpiece, the same minifigure in every set. Steve has an iron helmet and is equipped with an iron sword. The Alex minifigure has reddish brown legs, printed sand green torso back and front and printed Alex headpiece. Alex is equipped with an iron pickaxe and cookie for a light snack. The Alex minifigure is new to LEGO Minecraft this year and is only available in this set and the Never Fortress set. The Wolf minifigure has a light grey brick construction and moving tail. It has a unique printed headpiece that is very accurate to the game Wolf. The Wolf has a red collar showing it's tamed and the Wolf minifigure is new to LEGO Minecraft this year and unique to this set which will push up the popularity. There's two skeleton minifigures with the set, one without armour and just a wooden bow and arrow and the other with an iron helmet, armour and wooden bow and arrow. Skeleton mobs have been available in the last wave of LEGO Minecraft sets. The Desert Outpost has a wooden Minecraft door with sandstone base and blocks, stone block walls with engraved brick and a cactus on the side. The stone block tower has a defensive piston powered by the redstone torch to launch TNT onto the sand block mechanism. The mechanism launches four sand blocks to create an explosion and is easily reloadable. It's the same mechanism seen in the snow hideout set. Use the play feature again and again to blow the skeleton mob sky high and defend the outpost. Now moving on, there's a stream and small water slide so Steve can use his square wooden boat with smooth plates on the bottom to make a quick escape. There is also some growing wheat and sugar cane. The whole outpost is hinged so it can be opened up to make it less cramped and easier to manoeuvre minifigures and use the functions inside. The small house has a detachable roof and hinge in the middle. To reveal a small bed and entrance gate, it has bricked up windows for protection with nice stone wall effect. There's four torches that come with the set and lots of 2 by one dark bluish grey stone wall effect bricks that make great defensive walls around the whole outpost. LEGO have added lots of detachable sand blocks that let you place them around the outpost or stack them up like I'm doing now. Also, inside the outpost there's a furnace, crafting table and access ladder for Alex to climb and reach the TNT piston. The LEGO Minecraft The Desert Outpost set is the right price for 5 minifigures and lots of pieces including the TNT play feature. The play feature makes it fun and there's added playability with the water slide and hinged opening up function to make it more accessible and easy to play with. The wolf minifigure is unique to this set and will please fans of the game, but the other minifigures are quite underwhelming with limited weapons and armour. The build was really fun and the overall design looks great with a desert biome feel and added stone effect bricks. Brick Bros UK has given the set a brick rating of 4 bricks out of 5. Hope you enjoyed a Brick Bros UK unboxing and review. Like, comment and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.